The Ministry of Education is working towards providing a counselor in every school to meet the needs of the students. The program focuses not only in schools, but will also cater for residences that house children in the school system. Education Minister Dr. Rupert Rupnerine, in a recent interview with Gina, explained that the program could be boosted by returning retired teachers to work. We have, um, you know, a, a, a very, very large number of uh, recently retired teachers. You have teachers retiring at 55. At 55, they're really at the top of their game. I mean, these are people who now have accumulated a great deal of experience and so on, and you, you're saying, well, you know, it's time for you to go do something else. Well, I want really to look at this large group of retired teachers and recruit from within that group, um, and I'm going to be putting out public advertisements in effect, so that retired teachers can apply to the Ministry of Education. The aim is to boost the number of counselors in the system with experienced persons. This, in effect, will guarantee the effectiveness of the counseling being provided. I'm hoping to use this, this pool of resources um, to uh, really bring about a transformation in our capacity in relation to counseling, because these are precisely the people who I think that we should spend a great deal of time, um, you know, training as counselors. The Education Minister relayed that this will eventually contribute to his goal of having a counselor in every school, as seen in the U.S. and Canada. Dr. Rupnerai noted that Ghana may not be able to easily do this, but there is a need to begin moving in that direction. We must move in that direction so that we do have um, an adequate number of trained counselors um, so that we can look at establishing um, both the counseling secretariat here at the ministry and the distribution of counselors across the country. Minister Rupnirain stated that the program was one that would also require consultations with the relevant stakeholders. Rihanna, he said parents, teachers, students, and even employers in the private field would have to engage to ensure the success of the program.